That is a MJE 3055T transistor. Uh, 4001 diode going from the base from the emitter to the base negative to ground run batteries negative tied to the ground positive tied to the start or the inner drive coil Negative of the charge battery tied to the start of the inner drive coil. Out of the outer drive coil hits the collector with a 4007 or 4001 on the collector out to the positive of the charge battery. Out to the positive of the charge battery. There you go. That's a uh, that's a wheelchair wheel. I was gonna try to put a pulley on the uh, the hand the handle wheel there. And a bifiller coil about 150 feet gauge 23 and 26. Let's start her up. Drive battery has 11 volts. Those are N N28 or N32 neodymium magnets. Only 10 of them. What looks to be an 18 in, 18 inch wheel. Only 10 magnets. I'm sorry, nine nine magnets. This wheel is running on nine. Let me show you. One. Let's start where the coil is. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and that was one. So we have nine neodymium magnets on there on almost an 18 inch wheel. And it spins. It's more than two magnet widths apart. The magnets are set in, in a so fashion. This is one of three wheels, I think I have three wheels. There's another wheel that has, uh, that has uh, 16 magnets. Cheap 50 cent magnets. That one has 24 50 cent magnets, ceramic. like those right there and I have another little guy here runs too very nicely I think that's spinning a little faster same setup Charging my uh, rigid 18 volt battery with a 12 volt drive battery. At the same time, I'm paralleling this Motorola walkie talkie battery. Pay no attention to that. Over and out.